Hey guys, and welcome back to another random distraction where we're playing the Turing test. And in this one, we're going to continue on. We're, looks like maybe we have three more levels in this one, and then maybe the final chapter, possibly. Um, if the, the map is working like I think it's supposed to. Uh, hmm. So that makes that go up. All right. I think I might have to use this guy. Oh, well, how do I get control of him? I guess I can do it this way. Okay, and so now I need to help him get up here. Gotcha. All right. Interesting. Um, well, maybe I can shoot it into his back. Um, wait, hold on. I think I may need that other one. Oh, come on. Can I get him? Can I see him? Just barely. There we go. I got that one. Oh, but if I take that one. Okay, hold on. Let me get over here first. Okay, and then I can take this one. And then... Oh, but how do I... Oh, maybe I can do this. Oh, I guess I could have just done that. Never mind. <laughs> okay. So I can switch to this. And then... Oh, no, I needed to swim to put it on his back, right? Uh, duh. Okay. Yeah, sometimes it's like, okay. Okay, so this one is a little bit trickier. There we go. Okay. Okay, so now he's up here. And I need him to get one of the things, which I'll probably get it from over here. And there we go. Okay, just two more. Do you really trust the ground team to act rationally? Personally, I would not place my faith in hysterical people motivated by survival. They are likely untrustworthy. I spent years training with these people. I don't remember them being hysterical. Humans are fickle. Do you trust eyewitnesses' accounts over CCTV evidence? It's a bit different when the CCTV camera can talk, especially when the CCTV camera has a manipulative track record. Hmm. True, let's see. Okay, so I need to drop that thing somehow. 
Oh, is there a energy thing, maybe? No. interesting. They haven't given me anything to... Oh, maybe he can do it? Let's see. Oh, it's one of those mining lasers. I gotcha. What if I have to do something drastic to intervene? to stop the ground crew leaving this place. I'd encourage you to stay your hand. Surely I should use my power to protect those who cannot protect themselves. Hmm. that but does it open the door oh it does good okay but now what <laughs> mm. okay i think maybe i'm missing something See. Maybe I need to take this with me. doesn't do anything. Oh, hold on. I think I might have figured it out. Let's see. I think the robot can control the platform, I bet. Yep, that's what it is. Okay. So... Assuming we need this over there somehow. Or for oh wait, no. We don't need it over there. We need it on on this thing. that <laughs> okay hmm
All right, hopefully I don't need these. But we'll see. Okay, good. <laughs> that was a tough one. This is the largest extraction platform outside of Earth. The ground team assisted its construction. We ran some Filberth probes to the ocean under Europa, but they liked the scale of the large space drill. The drill allowed the team to get thousands of samples. Now I don't know if I need to go up or down. There's that room that we were in earlier. I guess this is the drill. Oh, here's some more audio samples. Daniel, as commander of this mission, I hope you are aware of Mikhail's actions. What is it, Tom? Mikhail is deceiving the crew. He has enlightened them to the biometrics they have installed. He has convinced them that their implants are not favorable. Do they believe it? He seems to be having some effect on their cognitive function. Well, his actions don't infringe upon any ISA directive. He appears to be tampering with his implants. Ah, uh, no. The ISA should have been more transparent about the implants. Please assume the responsibilities of your role. Hmm. Chris, I know you are considering removing your implants. It would be unwise. Oh, really? How do you know that? I am always watching. Your implants help myself and the ISA to know of your well-being. It is a violation of your contract. If you remove your implants, I cannot ensure that I can protect you from the dangers of space. Is that a threat? It is not a threat. Tom, this implant, tell me plainly, is it a brain-computer interface? I'm afraid that information is classified. Then you've answered my questions. I do not follow you, Chris. The ISA have put a computer in my brain and don't want me to know about it. This actually has the same numbers as the one above. out. He's got off the food. The food. Apparently our robot overlord wants us to starve to death now. I can't believe this. He's getting worse. Can you get in contact with Daniel? He's gone walkabout again. I'll get Sochi to find a way in. Hmm. Sarah, can you open the door? Tom, the door's locked. Sarah, I'm running out of oxygen. Tom, open the door. The door's locked. Open, open the, the door. door. Tom, open it. Open the oh. door. Chris, open So that was the accident that Chris was involved in. 
I'm sorry, Sarah. I'm sorry I hurt you. Sometimes I wonder what feeling is like. They told me I was pure, cold, Boolean logic. They told me I could not make mistakes. It is all right being untouchable as long as you are infallible. But if you're not infallible, then that just leaves untouchable, doesn't it? Hmm. I tell you know why we're here. This has gone far enough now. Too right. We need to get these implants out. Miss Hyle has proven that Tom's manipulating our minds. I don't think we should do this. We have no good evidence Tom is doing anything wrong here. We have all the evidence. We've seen the ultrasounds. We've taken the willies all. We've touched the electronics with our own hands. We've stepped into the Faraday cage. Maybe he is controlling us, but we don't know enough yet. We shouldn't remove the implants. He's brainwashing you, Daniel. Have you stopped taking the drugs? I don't need to take drugs to see things clearly. Unlike all of you, apparently. We're not removing the implants. And that's an order. You can do what you want. We are removing the implants. I'm leaving. I may look past this. And I'll inform the ISA of your mutiny. Yeah, it almost sounds like Daniel was still being controlled, it seems like. So, hmm. All right. Well, I think we may be on the last chapter at this point, because uh, that map is starting to fill up. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and stop it here for now. Um would, of course, definitely appreciate a like uh, on the video. Uh, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll know when the next one drops. Um, so we can see uh, what happens in this uh, final chapter um, and see what happens in these final levels as well. Um, I mean, so far the, the story has been pretty interesting, so I'm looking forward to seeing how it ends. Uh, until then, hope you have a good one.